This is a very important video if you want to set up your business on Amazon.ae. We're going to go through the process step by step, so keep on watching. Regardless of where you live, you can actually sell on Amazon.ae. This is going to be the video that reveals the very first step of how to actually set up your Amazon seller account on Amazon.ae. However, I do recommend that you watch other videos on this channel. I'm going to leave all the links in the description box below because you need more information to figure out exactly how to create a business on Amazon. I also suggest that you join the membership and become a member of Amazon Seller Society Middle East because when you become a member, we will teach you all the subsequent steps that you need in order to grow your business successfully on Amazon.ae. We actually have members from several countries all working on their businesses on Amazon.ae. You'll find all the information again in the description box below. So let's jump into it. I'm going to be referencing a lot of information in this video. I don't want to keep repeating myself, but I will leave you all the links that you need in the description box below. So don't worry about it. Just focus on the steps and then you can open the description box and you can find all the links that you need. Step number one is choosing your marketplace. Where do you want to sell? Do you know that Amazon have 16 different marketplaces that you can actually sell on? You have the US, Mexico, Canada, Italy, Germany, the UK, Spain, France, Italy, India, China, Japan, Australia, the UAE and Singapore, as well as three new emerging markets, Korea, Taiwan and Thailand, which aren't actually functioning at the moment, but they are in the pipeline. Now, as you've seen, the only a country that is in the Middle East is the UAE and that is a very big advantage and that's why I'm going to be focusing on the UAE as a marketplace for you to start selling in. There are definitely a lot of pros and cons for you to start selling on Amazon.ae because it's definitely, it's definitely not as big as Amazon.com in the US or even Amazon.co.uk in the UK. However, you can start selling on Amazon.ae and you can learn how to build a business in a marketplace that is relatively new and a marketplace that doesn't have extreme amounts of competition. And then you can grow and expand globally. This is something that you can do. Now, choosing a marketplace has nothing to do with where you live this is something that you need to know it doesn't matter where you live because chances are if you do opt to sell through the fba program which is the fulfilled by amazon program your inventory is going to leave your manufacturer wherever that manufacturer is and it's going to go all the way to the amazon fba warehouse and chances are you're not going to even see your inventory. So it doesn't really matter if you do or you don't live in the UAE. So for step number one, choosing a marketplace, you don't have a choice. You're going to start selling on Amazon.ae. Step number two, choosing your business entity. How are you going to register on Amazon.ae? Are you going to register using your business license or are you going to register using your personal credentials? This is where it gets a little bit confusing for some people. So yes, you can do both, but you have to make a decision based on where you live. And this is how most people make decisions. So there are for every single different Amazon marketplace, there are accepted countries that can register on that particular marketplace. And if you happen to live in one of those accepted countries, then you can easily register using your own personal credentials. And no, you do not need a business license. Even if you live in the UAE, you can register as a person, as an individual, because 
you are selling on the Amazon marketplace and not on your own website, you do not need an e-commerce license. However, if you do not live in a country that is accepted by Amazon, then you have no other choice but to register as a business and you have to create a business in a country that is accepted by Amazon.ae. And no matter where you live, you can opt to register a company, not necessarily in the UAE if you find it a little bit well, a little bit hard or maybe a bit more expensive than it would be to register, for example, a company in Turkey. You can you have to do your own research and you have to decide where you want to register your company. Now, with that being said, you also need to make sure that whatever country you live in also is accepted currency wise by Amazon. What do I mean by that? For example, you can register as a person living in KSA, you can register as an individual on Amazon.ae. However, Amazon will not accept to send you money directly to your bank account in KSA because the real is not a currency that Amazon actually converts to. So this is where you're going to have a problem. So you are going to be able to open your account. However, you're not able to have a bank account in KSA. What are your options if, if you happen to have this issue? If your currency, if your country is accepted, however, your currency is not accepted, your only option is to use a third party money transfer service such as Payoneer. Previously, Payoneer was not accepted on Amazon.ae. However, in recent weeks, it's, it's accepted now and you can use Payoneer in order to send all your money that you are making on Amazon.ae to your Payoneer account, from your Payoneer account to your bank account, wherever you live. Number three, what about the products that you want to sell? Are there products that you can and cannot sell? Well, yes, there are some categories that require further approval by Amazon because Amazon is, well, it's a reliable website and it doesn't want to harm any customer buying any product from its website, even if it doesn't technically own these products. You own these products and you're selling them through Amazon. However, there are around 28 open categories that you can sell in very easily without getting any issues from Amazon and without requesting any permission or any additional or Amazon requesting any additional paperwork from you. So there are a lot of options for you to sell products on Amazon other than a mobile phone or a perfume bottle. So you need to think a little bit outside of the box because the options are there and the, the products are, well, the, the options of selling products are endless. You just need to know what to look for. Okay, now you have everything ready. Now you understand how you are going to be able to register your account, your seller's account on Amazon. What do you do now? Well, where do you go in order to sign up as a seller? Very easy. You can actually go to services.amazon.ae and that's the website that opens up for you to start registering. Or you can also go to the Amazon.ae website and go to the bottom of the page and just click on sell on Amazon.ae and this is where you're going to be redirected to the same exact website. So make sure you start with a fresh email. Just create a completely new email using Gmail, for example, for your Amazon.ae seller account. What about the account types? What about the account types? What types of accounts are there on Amazon.ae? Well, the only type of account currently available on Amazon.ae is the best type of third party seller account, which is known as the pro account or the professional account. 
on other marketplaces such as Amazon.com and Amazon Europe and all these other marketplaces, you have two types of accounts. You have the individual account and the pro account, which will cost you around $40 every single month, whether you do make a sale or not. However, with that being said, please don't, uh, don't get confused. Because again, every single marketplace on Amazon has a different type of system that you need to follow. So on Amazon.ae, you only have one type of account, which is the pro account, which is again, the best type of account. And to register for the pro account, it will be free. It's currently free. You don't have to pay anything to register on Amazon.ae. And yes, you can register your account today and start selling in a few months. It's fine. It doesn't matter. That's why I recommend that you register as soon as possible in order to benefit from the special offer of being for free because nobody really knows how long it's going to stay like this. I hope you found this video informative and it cleared up a lot of information that was vague. If you did, just leave me a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to this channel because it supports us. And I'll see you in another video with more information. Bye for now.